Hello, I'm Bernard Hickey from interest.co.nz and welcome to 90 at 9. This is your morning briefing where you get everything you need to know in 90 seconds at 9 o'clock. Starting now with news that Spanish bond yields have gone back to euro era highs. The meltdown in the southern European bond markets continues. The 10 year Spanish bond yield rose to 6.83%. Remember, anything over 6%, very difficult to pay back. Anything close to 7 utterly unsustainable. The Italian 10 year bond yield up to 6.28% overnight. This is all about a capital flight by wholesale investors from Southern Europe, taking the euros out of Southern Europe into Germany because they fear a breakup of the euro and that the German version of the euro will be much stronger than whatever is left in Spain or Italy. And that's why we see the German 10 year bond down at 1.48%. Remember, if you're selling Italian and Spanish bonds, their price goes down, their yield goes up. You go into German bonds, you buy them, their price goes up, the yields goes down. This is all about no confidence in the future of the Eurozone. And to reinforce that, Fitch downgraded 18 Spanish banks overnight and the Austrian finance minister warned of an Italian bailout at some stage. However, markets, for stocks at least, were up overnight. The Dow rose 1.1%. There is fresh hope that the central banks will rescue everyone with hopes for a stimulus from the US Federal Reserve when it meets next Wednesday. There were comments overnight from Charles Evan, the renowned dove, about the need for more stimulus. In New Zealand, retail spending figures were relatively strong. Credit and debit card figures for May were up 0.8% and that was stronger than forecast. Remember our housing markets in, in Auckland and Christchurch doing pretty well. We have the Reserve Bank making its decision tomorrow. Most economists are expecting no rate cut, slight chance according to the markets. But it's likely the Reserve Bank will keep its powder dry, waiting to see what happens in Europe. We may get rate cuts later if things get much worse in Europe, as the current news suggests it will. I'm Bernard Hickey. That was 90 at 9 from interest.co.nz.